U.S. consumer prices declined for the first time since April 2013 in August, the Labor Department announced Wednesday. The consumer price index dipped 0.2 percent, a decline in energy prices of 2.6 percent offset increases in food and shelter costs. The drop followed by a 0.1 percent gain in July. The index for all items excluding food and energy was unchanged in August, the first month since October of 2010 that the index did not increase. NASA awarded Boeing and SpaceX to build commercially owned and operated space taxis that will fly astronauts to the International Space Station, ending U.S. dependence on Russia for rides, U.S. Senator Bill Nelson said on Tuesday. Escalating tensions with Russia over its annexation of the Crimea region of Ukraine, as well as sanctions enacted against the country, have given a new urgency to the contract. Boeing C ST-100 spaceship would launch aboard Atlas V rockets built by United Launch Alliance, a partnership of Lockheed Martin and Boeing. SpaceX, which already has a $1.3 billion NASA contract to fly cargo to the space station, intends to upgrade its Dragon freighters to carry astronauts, the Associated Press reports. Come see the borrowing side of Sears. The struggling retailer announced it had secured a $400 million loan this week from a hedge fund whose sole shareholder is the company's chairman, CEO, and leading investor, Eddie Lampert. Sears, which lost $1 billion during the first half of the year, said in a statement to CNN Money that the deal does not create a conflict of interest as it is in the best interest of the company. Reporting from Millionaire Corner, I'm Heather Kiley. Thanks so much for watching.